Beth, welcome to Derby. How are you settling into the place? Yeah, no, I'm really enjoying it. The girls have been great. Sam's been great. So it's been, they've made it really easy for me. I'm really enjoying it. And you're not a total stranger in the sense that you played against Derby last season with, with your former club. How was that experience? Yeah, I played against them once. Um, yeah, it was a really good game, actually. Really close. Um, and yeah, I enjoyed playing them. What has Sam, the manager, said to you about how she sees your role in the team? Yeah, I think just explaining to me the differences, the requirements, because Derby, their centre mid's playing a slightly different way. So it's just kind of teaching me the role and learning what to do, where to run. Um, but yeah, it's be, she's been really helpful and helped me from the games that I've played in. Uh, you've captained Birmingham's 21s before. You, you've captained Wales under 19s as, as well. What stands out from your career so far for you? Yeah, I think there's been quite a few, but I think captaining my team for Wales um, and finishing higher than we ever had before, I think that's a massive achievement because no one thought that we could do it. Um, so we kind of defied the odds and that was the best, really. Just finally, what can fans expect from you? What sort of player are you? I think total commitment, box-to-box -box midfielder, technical ability, and hopefully that can help the team overall. Shalei, welcome to Derby. How does it feel to be here? Great. Um, I'm really enjoying my time here so far and I'm excited for the season. Had a few games under your belt in, in pre-season as well. It sounds as though you've settled in quite quickly. Yeah. Um, I scored my first goal, uh, my first game. And yeah, I'm just excited to see where I go. What was it about Derby that appealed to you at this stage of your career? Um, it was a club with good ambition um, and I could see myself playing here. You've been involved with the England youth setup in the past. Tell me about that experience. What sticks out from it, from that for you? Um, definitely making my debut for my country. Um, I mean, like it was a great day. Um, so yeah. What Sam, the manager, said about how she sees you fitting in this season for Derby? Um, as the number nine, um, scoring goals, using my pace. So yeah. And and how are you getting on with the girls so far? There's yeah. A, there's a few new faces, isn't there? Yeah, um, obviously I know Daisy from England and stuff, but uh, all the girls have been very welcoming and, yeah, grateful for that. Daisy, welcome to Derby. How are you finding life here at Moore Farm so far? Yeah, really enjoying it. Um, the girls have been lovely so far and Sam's really helped me settle in, so, yeah, enjoying it. The accent will be a bit of a clue for people. You are a, a long way from home, so how are you finding the adjustment and, and how's it going to work being away from Newcastle? Yeah, um, I've always lived in Newcastle and all my family are from Newcastle. So, um, yeah, it was a big move to come down here and, you know, be away from home. But, yeah, it's a, it's a move I'm really looking forward to, to thriving on and hopefully I can help the girls. First time away from home? Or yeah, first time. Enjoying it so far? Yeah, really enjoying it, actually. We've got some family friends that live down this way, so um, they've really helped me settle in. And I think football runs in the family, isn't it? So, so yeah. what do your dad and I think your uncle make yeah. of, of, of your career? Yeah, my dad always says, like, you know, you've played for Newcastle and I never quite got there. So, yeah, I, I think I've got one up on him. And my uncle just always tells us to just enjoy it as much as I can because, you know, it doesn't last long. What can fans expect from you? What sort of player are you? Yeah, passionate. Um, I wear my heart on my sleeve and always give 100%. So, yeah, I'm really looking forward to it see what I can bring to the, uh, the team.